And you know, traditionally, B.A., when big guys match up, it's all about the power. But this contest is about finesse. Who can outplay and outsmart the competition? All right, let's check out the starting lineup for the Trailblazers. We've got Sharp, and it's Walker in at the four. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. Exclamation three from Wiggins. Here's Sharp. He's guarded by Beasley. Sharp passes to Drexler. Back to Sharp. Here's Drexler. Six to shoot. And that one is stuffed right through. That was a clever move, slicing his way past the taller defender and finishing with some flavor. Here's Young. Second shot opportunity. And a nice layup by Hunter. Have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Reason why, lack of focus, lack of communication, which led to second chance points. Here's Drexler. 17 points in his last outing. It's good. Well, this gives you some confidence when you drop three straight to start the game. Young, the pass to Hunter. And down it goes. Jam that one home. All he needed was a little separation. So effective. Boy, cleared the path, put him in position for a prime time dunk. That's a big time move and a big time finish. Now here's Walker. He's averaging almost five points a game. Here's Yao. Count the basket. A lost art in this game. Terrific bounce pass. Outside Hunter. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Young's got three assists in the game. They have really found a rhythm here early. Four for five to start this game. Here's Ellis. Last game for him, he had 14. Pass to Walker. Here's Ellis. Over Hunter. Deflected. And they'll turn it over. Couldn't get the shot off. A shot clock violation. Now, if you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. Wiggins from long range. The second effort. Another shot. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Hawks. Right now is their passing game, and it's been on point. Doing a great job of moving it around and getting the ball to their shooters. And what's more, they're getting their feet wet down there in the paint early on. Not shying away at all, taking it inside. What a great way to start. Oh, wasted no time on that one. Drexler's got six. I love this approach. Getting him involved early, and it's already paying off. It makes sense, right? You're trying to get off to a fast start, and he can help with that. Here's Ellis. Checking his stats, he's scoring around nine and a half points per game. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. And now it's time to look at the teams that have really impressed shooting from the field during the last ten games. The Hawks, number one. They've just been taking smarter, higher percentage shots, and they are hitting them with regularity right now. Good on both. Atlanta's gone one for three from beyond the arc. Young finds Hunter. Beasley for three. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. A certified specialist. Beasley will never hesitate to take that shot. Henderson outside. Launches it from deep. Again, the miss by the Trailblazers. The Hawks leading. Here's Wiggins. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, what a creative dunker Wiggins is. It's really fun watching him rise up and finish with power. Pass to Gugliotta. Here's Drexler. Six points for him. Down to five on the shot clock. Shoots over Wiggins. And too long on the shot. You expect him to make that, especially from that distance. Gugliotta, his turn, team second. And he drops the first. No good on the second free throw. The Trailblazers have gone five of eight. Solid opening quarter for them. Basket counts. Woohoo! 
just great work cashing in on the fast break. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. And this kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game right now, B.A. You know, there's an edge the way they play and a confidence they're not afraid to show. Timeout called, Portland. And as the coaches draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's key to keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. And he bangs it home with one hand. Incredible work right there on the glass. Just doing all he can to extend that lead. Hey, once you got him on the ropes, keep swinging away. You know why? Because this defense is really. They had to stop there but couldn't secure the rebound. They're still looking for answers. Ooh, good chance here for Hunter. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Leave a gap that size and Trey Young will spot it. And then he'll exploit it. Noah passes to Drexler. Inside. Second chance effort, and he sinks the layup. Back in the day, someone would have blocked him out, but times have changed. And a deep three from Young sinks the tray. And I'm just impressed with their effort here early. They've hit the offensive glass so hard. Six second difference between the shot clock and game clock. It's a three on three fast break. And the Hawks with another three. Their defense has to do a better job of smothering those shooters. Here's Drexler, pounded by Wiggins. And Andrew Wiggins gets the whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. And yeah, he, he still was moving at the point of contact. Ellis passes to Harrington. Now Young with a steal. And here they come. And that one's good. Knox. That's what Trey Young does best defensively. He has quick hands for the steal, and he ignites the break. And an overpowering first quarter effort. Already a double-digit advantage. Hawks ahead, up by 15. And we'll get things started in the second quarter when we return. And so far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. You know, for the Hawks, this has been the game they've wanted to have. Well, they've really been racking up three-pointers in bunches. They've been so impressive to watch. And that's their strategy. Try to overwhelm you. Try to put you in a hole you have to dig yourself out of. Senti Aldama out there with Andrew Wiggins. And it's Murray, and it's Black in at the point guard position. That's the group starting the second quarter for the Hawks. Henderson for three. Altama grabs the board. Atlanta's got four of seven threes to go so far in this game. Murray. And it's Murray finishing it off. The Dante Murray loves to play with flair, and he did not hold back on that dunk. Here's Morris. It's deflected. Hunter, good. Hunter's got 17 points. They have no answer defensively inside. Morris deciding where to go with it. Pass to Harrington. Count it. And it's Morris with the assist. Sometimes it's simple. Put the ball in the hands of your scorers and let them do what they do best. Smitty, if you could choose one current guy to play alongside, who would it be? Ooh, that's a tough question, B.A., but I'm going to go with Steph Curry. I think the reason why is because of the range he shoots it with. It will give me a lot of room on the other side to get buckets. Sharp, he's checked in for Portland. Portland calls timeout. It's been fun watching this player do his thing lately. Our player of the week for the Eastern Conference. He's a great example of what a modern big looks like. He's so much more than just a big in the paint. And that versatility is a big part of what makes him such an outstanding player. Now here's Henderson. As far as his production, he's averaging about eight points per game. Misses with a tough leaning jump shot. 
Murray for three. Hits the trifecta. Murray's got five points in the quarter. He drops yet another dime. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. And that's his third foul. The chance you take leaving him in with two. Let's see if they'll sit him now until the half. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Ellis has checked in. Off the inbound. That's good on the jumper. Nice pass. You love how sharp anticipates situations. You know, Smitty, we've seen some ridiculous leapers in the NBA. But Shaden Sharp is at another level. Yeah, Grant. Some reports they have his vertical jump at 50 inches. He can posterize anyone in this league. And one of those guys who is capable of doing crazy dunks. Here's Sharp. Still no points. Five to shoot. Shoots over Wiggins. Sharp, no good. And it didn't register as an official block, but he did everything you want in disrupting that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good job of contesting without committing the foul. Those are precisely the looks this team is trying to create. You know, if you get the ball to the right guy in the right spot, more often than not, you're coming away with points. And that puts them just one foul from the bonus. And the Blazers making a change here. Atlanta on D. Ellis passes to Gugliotta. Pass to Ellis. To the paint. With the teardrop. Here's Wiggins. Foul called. Looked like the D didn't get there in time. And he'll shoot free throws. Yeah, the first overall pick in 2014, Andrew Wiggins has carved out a nice career as a scoring wing. And he's good on the second. The Trailblazers have got two of seven attempts to drop since the end of the first quarter. Drexler passes to Sharp. Cash money on the open jump shot. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Pass to Aldama from deep. Ellis with a rebound. Portland has gone one of two from deep in the second quarter. Deflects the pass. Ooh, stolen by Murray. Here's Hunter. Yes! Oh, oh, my goodness. Come on now, guys. That's flat out insane. Hey, when's the last time you saw a jam like that? Pass to Drexler. Out to the right wing. Six on the shot clock. They set the pick. Here's Ellis. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Good man. The defender really went after him. First free throw is good. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Both good from the line that time. Atlanta's gotten six of ten three-pointers to drop. Black passes to Aldama. Knocks down the triple. Aldama's got five points in the quarter. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Harrington. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. And you like the balance here. Not just falling in love with the three ball. Pass to Black. Here's Murray. And it's Portland with a rebound. I understand why he pulled up for the leaner right there. But the defense adjusted to that very well. Sharp passes to Ellis. Back to Sharp. Here's Harrington. Defended by Murray. Back to Sharp. The three. Hunter with the rebound. Hunter's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Basket's good. Wiggins got 11 points. So reliable. They've really leaned on him at the offensive end. Here's Sharp. He came away with 14 points in his last game. Sharp's in his groove now. Don't let him get started. Atlanta's gone three of four from outside so far in the second quarter. 35 seconds left in the first half. Aldama. Noah grabs the board. For Portland, they've gotten five of their first 11 shots to fall here in the second quarter. Here's Drexler, defended by Murray. From nine feet out, 
Another shot, and the basket by Noah. Noah's done a nice job on the offensive glass, wreaking havoc for the defense. Up top, Wiggins. Murray for three. What a play! He drains it at the buzzer! What a huge shot to beat the buzzer. My goodness. He had to rush that one a little, but terrific stroke from range. So as we conclude the first half, a fairly one-sided game. The Hawks on top, delivering the blowout. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. Hello, everybody. We're here to break it all down, and through the first half of play, it's a very commanding lead for the Atlanta Hawks. Okay, hold up. We have a major situation here in the studio. Someone took my notebook. Who has it? Did you check everywhere, Ernie? Because I did not take it. Don't look at me, Kenny. I didn't touch it. Did you look under your desk? Oh, what do you know? That's exactly where it is. Uh, never mind. And looking now at that first half of action, quite a big deficit for the Trailblazers. They left the floodgates to the paint wide open, offering up driving lanes. They're getting bullied. Makes me sick to watch. Hmm. You know what? That would have never happened, Shaq, if you were protecting that room. And that'll do it for us. Thanks for stopping by. We'll head back down to Brian Anderson and crew for the start of the third quarter. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. Atlanta is shooting the ball incredibly well tonight, 73% from the floor. So the Trail Blazers five right now. We've got Walker, and it's Ellis in at the one. The fadeaway. Again, the miss by Murray. Pass to Drexler. Walker for three. Hunter with the rebound. Hunter's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Fires from the line. Count that one. Hunter's got 21. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. The reason why they've stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. He's doing what he can do to pull them closer, but it's not enough. He needs more help. Here's Black. Another one falls for Atlanta. Right now, he's being too passive and not looking for a shot enough. He needs to be more aggressive and get more shots up because he's shooting well. Here's Sharp. He has seven. Pass to Ellis. Clock at six. Charity stripe shot, and the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. The officials were right on top of that one. Taking two shots. That free throw, no good. Good on the second one. Right around a minute and a half played in the third quarter. Young from long range, and again for three. Well, we expect him to come in firing. It's just another three-point barrage. What a phenomenal run it's been for him. Nearing fifth on the list for most triples in a year. Over to the wing. Here's Ellis. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Ellis has got four points now in the quarter. Exchanging buckets from downtown. That's been a staple of tonight's game. Hey, players love competition, and the fans love it as well. No good on that one. He hits the second from the line. And he nails the third. The Hawks have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. 
Young, the pass to a Kongwu. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Pass to Sharp. Second half of play here with just under two and a half minutes passed. Here's Yao. Hunter with the rebound. Hunter's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Oh, the Hawks again cannot hit it. Yeah, and the defense really respects his shooting ability, and they showed it with that tight coverage. Johnson finds a Kongwu. It's blocked! Here's Ellis. Pass to Sharp. Here's Yao, guarded by a Kongwu. Yao, shot is off. Get that weak stuff out of here. That's embarrassing. Murray, shot is good. Every time I see Murray, I'm reminded that he has a lot of moves around the cup. Here's Sharp, defended by Murray. Goes up on the wing. Jump shot is good. Sharp's got nine points. Efficient performance from him. Not the case for everyone else on his team. Back to Young. Pass to Murray. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Young's got his sixth assist of the night. Beautiful play by DeJounte Murray. What contest. Here's Ellis. Give him eight points now. Another one falls for Portland. The defense was certainly a little late in reacting to the step back. Here's Young. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. He's got 11. When Trey Young is spilling it, he can rip up a defense. Quick release and a confident stroke. Walker, a screen on Murray. Here's Drexler, covered by Johnson. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Hawks. I just love how they're taking advantage of their chances to run. And they're pushing it. Fast break points can win you ball games. Well, they've also been impressive, forcing a ton of mistakes. Not only that, but converting those mistakes into points on the other end. Now here's Young. He's got 11. Pass to Johnson. Three-pointer. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Yao's got four rebounds now. Here's Ellis, guarded by Young. Here's Gugliata. Here's Drexler. Sinks it from distance. Drexler's got seven points for the quarter. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do. Good! Another from three. And for this franchise now, he's hit the most threes in a single season. His incredible range stretches out the defense on a nightly basis. It's an invaluable element to this offense. They're really looking to that inside game here in the second half, getting away from taking a bunch of threes. I love that Trey Young puts his passes on target and in spots where his teammates are comfortable playing. Ellis passes to Drexler to the wing, right side. Ooh, stolen by Murray. In transition, here they come. There's Young with the three. It's good. And the assist goes to Murray. Having a monster night from beyond the arc. He had two bombs in the first half. Now three more since. That one goes. Count it. The name of the game isn't scoring. It's scoring efficiency. Young finds Murray. And he drives in. And there's the rejection. And so it looks like it'll be Atlanta's ball. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Yeah, I love that they maintain the defensive energy even when they're behind. Young way outside. And as we conclude the third, pretty much a blowout here. It's been a one-sided affair. Hawks ahead, just dominating this one. After a quick break, we're coming right back with the start of the fourth quarter. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. Now, I know he's a big man, 
but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. Let me tell you, when you can run offense through your bigs, you give the defense just another thing it has to try and take away. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. The talented duo of Young and Murray of the backcourt. Onyeka Kongwu is out there with Cameron Johnson. And it's Hunter in at the center position. So that's the Hawks' five. And he's going for the oop here. Five on the clock. And the basket by Noah. Smooth offense. Gets them the perfect low-risk look. To the right side. Here's a Kongwu. Oh, hits the outside fadeaway. Ooh, interesting choice going for the fadeaway. An unnecessary flourish in that case. Pass to Noah. Here's Sharp, covered by Johnson. Here's Drexler. Tries again, and he lays it up and in. Drexler's got 13 in the second half. Relentless on the offensive glass, and then you love the finish. Portland has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. And a Kongwu with the block. Pass to Murray. The three is up. Buckets. He's now 6 of 10 from the field. Hard to win games when you allow clean looks from the perimeter. Now a timeout called by Portland. And coach most likely wants to address their turnover issues. The offense looks forced right now. Rush, there's no synergy to it. They have to find a way to work together and remain aggressive without making mistakes. Walker, he's checked in for Portland. Here's Sharp. Hunter covering. That's tipped. Here's the break. Here's Murray. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Good example of the new breed of point guards. Murray creates for himself as well as he creates for others. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. And we're about two minutes into the fourth now. Ellis passes to Sharp. Takes one from 10 feet. Got a hand on it. So quick off the floor, Murray can afford to wait until the shooter commits. From deep, Johnson. Noah grabs the board. The Trailblazers have gone 2 of 5 from the field in this final quarter. Oh, got that bucket in no time at all. Attacking the defense with the pass. Don't need to be a hero. Young from long range. Ooh, now 7 for 9 after that make. He hit a couple from range in the first half, but now his confidence is through the roof. Sharp passes to Gugliana. Here's Ellis, guarded by Young. Rejected by a Kongwu. With the step back. Here's Johnson. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. He's shaking the hoop. He's actually shaking the whole building. Oh, what a slam. Look here, the fans going crazy right now. Pass to Ellis, and the whistle blows. It's going to be on Trey Young. That's his first foul. The Trailblazers making a switch here. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Trey Young. That'll be a second foul of the game. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. Walker against the Kongwu. Here's Yao. And it's blocked. Outside Hunter. Walker pulls down the board. Mm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. May have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. Here's Yao. And it's flushed down. A nice jam. This is basketball 101. This is the size mismatch you look to create. Here's Murray. That's in. Coming off an assist from Young. Murray's got seven points here in the quarter. Absolutely ruthless. He's not about to start showing mercy now. Expanding upon this lead, trying to close it out. He's really stepped up. Shot clock at six. It's tipped. 
Young from long range. Another three for Atlanta. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of creating space. You got a piece of it. Here's Atlanta now. They're on a 17-6 run. And let's face it, this one was never really in question. They came out with purpose and just overwhelmed the opposition. A great win for the Hawks. And the disparity in the talent was obvious by the end. Sometimes you just don't have enough ammunition to compete. Yeah, B.A., just a total beatdown. And the next time these teams meet, <laughs> I can't imagine it'll be any different. And their win total will climb a little higher once this one's official. It'll be their 63rd win of the year. And even though this season series was only two games, a sweep is still a sweep. And what a huge performance it was for Big Dog. You no, know, there's a few ways to control a game, right? You can do it with pace. You can do it with patience and efficiency. Tonight, he did it by owning the boards. This is what you do when your opponents try to take away the three and the painted area. Picked up by a Kongwu. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Drexler passes to Sharp. Fires in the triple. This is why you gotta be excited about Sharp's future. He's so assertive on the offensive end. From nine feet. Count it. He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. So we see the Hawks taking the W here. Boy, they were something special to watch tonight. And the crowd loving every second of it. It's always a great feeling when you play this well for your fans. This team really showed what it's capable of. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Steve Smith, this is Brian Anderson with our 2K Sports crew signing off. We leave you now with our New Balance Player of the Game. Don't call my phone, don't call my phone, don't call my phone